Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. We got a quick update for you for Escape from Tarkov. We got some Nikki leaks, and I want to talk a little bit about the roadmap and the update for Halloween and what we know and what we don't know. So let's not waste any time and get right into it. Okay, so first up, we got a picture from Nikita with a bullet. Uh, led to a lot of speculation from folks, but pretty straightforward. This is M885, um, I'm sorry, M80A1. So it's gonna be, I think 855A1's big brother. Same kind of bullet. IRL, um, the way the the, uh, the projectile is made, it's just bigger. It's 30 cal versus 5.56. But where this fits in the game, hopefully, is something that's going to sit between M80 and M61 because we have a giant gap. And I know there's a lot of people that are like, well, M62 is in between. And no, it's not. M62 is a baby step above M80. And to be honest with you, M80 doesn't have any reason to be better than M80, in my opinion, especially with pen. But this round will give us an intermediate round. When we get this, I don't know. Hopefully, we'll get it with the next patch, the content patch, which is supposed to be 15.5. We'll talk more about that in a sec, um, but it might not be till the next wipe with patch what we think is going to be 16. So there's that. And then the one that's on everybody's mind is the Halloween event. It is the 29th. So clock's ticking. We're getting really close to Halloween. And all we got from Nikita was don't worry about Halloween event, my friends. OK sign, right? We were told we as in streamers or anybody really that was down at TwitchCon um, that was talking with BSG that there was a Halloween event. It was going to be super awesome and you didn't want to miss it. BSG was adamant about that with several streamers, including myself, that you didn't want to miss the Halloween event. So they obviously have something pretty big planned. Whether this delay is intended or not, who knows uh, if it's even a delay. Maybe they're going to drop the Halloween event on Halloween and then it's going to run for a week. I hope that's what they do. They need to run the event over a weekend to give normal gamers a chance to really partake in it so they don't have to play on a weekday. Especially those of us that have kids, you don't have time to play on Halloween. You're running around with your little rugrats taking them out to get candy. So we shall see what this ends up with. Um, I'm still positive there's going to be a Halloween event. Uh, we just don't know when it's going to start. But anytime now, soon, soon, TM. Okay, now let's talk roadmap um, because this is where kind of the Halloween event, some of this other stuff falls in. They gave us this roadmap, I believe, on the 24th of September, over, over a month ago. It was right before TwitchCon. And unfortunately, we haven't seen any of it. We were told patch 2.2 for Arena, which was going to give us the new map. Here, I'll zoom in so you guys can actually see it, which was going to give us the new map and some other stuff was going to be weeks after TwitchCon, like kind of felt like two weeks. That never happened. Obviously, we never got the update to patch 15 on Arena, which brings it, you know, it'll bring in like the M, assumedly it would bring in the M60, the Deagle, Recoil, Armor, a bunch of the stuff like that that is changed with 15. The Unity 2022 update and patch 15.5. Now for me, I was expecting all of this pretty much by now. Uh, the fall weather season kind of led me to believe that this was going to be involved with um the halloween event and then hopefully like i said that's where we get this m80 a1 uh round with this update but we haven't seen any of it yet and my suspicion i don't have any like inside information this is just what i'm thinking is that the unity update is hanging this all up anybody might know more about this than me but i'm pretty sure that if they are developing patches in unity 2022 which they're obviously going to be doing um, they can't install those patches in, I think we're in Unity 2019 right now. Don't quote me on that. I'm pretty sure of it, but not 100%. I didn't double check it. Uh, they can't do that. So we have to get Unity 2022 into the game before we can do patch 15.5. Um, this leads me to believe and wonder if 15.4 and 15.5 are just going to get mashed together into one patch. Um, maybe they don't. Maybe we do the Halloween event and we don't get any of this stuff. You know, maybe my assumption's wrong that this is attached to the Halloween event, but Either way, I do believe we're waiting on the Unity update. Now, I can't talk about it a whole bunch. There is there is stuff going on in the ETS, but the it's, it's kind of an NDA. It's not technically an NDA, but if you talk about the ETS, you get kicked out of the ETS. So I'm not going to um, or talk about what's going on in there. So I can't give specifics on the stuff that's in the ETS. But needless to say, I believe this is the linchpin right now holding everything else up. Um, again, I could be wrong. Now, does that apply to Arena? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know why we're not seeing any of this stuff. Obviously, something didn't happen correctly because BSG didn't stick with any kind of timeline hint that they gave us, which shit happens. Like, it sucks. I'm not going to get super upset with it. I would rather them take the extra week or two or three or month or whatever to make sure it works right and not upload a broken buggy patch that we can't even play the game. So that's kind of where I'm at with it. Um, there's a lot of other stuff to come with the roadmap that's supposed to be till the end of 2024, whether they're going to meet this or not. Pretty sure that patch 16 is going to be wipe, which would be, you know, end of December, probably. 
there's a chance that wipe gets pushed past December now if everything's being delayed like this or maybe they just grind it out and get it done beforehand who knows um, but there's a lot of stuff to get done now in just basically 60 days maybe a little more than 60 days two months they've got to supposedly get all this done it's doable I guess we'll just have to wait and see but that's it quick little update just wanted to talk about where we were at what we saw what we knew what we don't know and what i was assuming so hope this was helpful hope it gets you guys up to speed as always i wish you guys the best of luck in your raids and we'll see you in tarkov